guys i hope it's not really annoying if i wear these glasses um i've got first of all i had a really bad breakout the other day because it was it, it, it's just finished being that time secondly i've just burnt my finger so i'm running my finger underwater my mum told me to run my finger underwater because i burnt it quite badly she told me to run it underwater for ages but i don't have ages because i have a rehearsal basically i'm in a show and it's like a compilation show of like broadway songs and dances and things like that the show is this week so i thought it would be fun to vlog i'm in a bit of a rush right now basically i have had for about maybe for about two years like since i've been with mike say i've had incredibly blurry vision most of the time i'm sorry this is really distracting isn't it i'll take them off so i've had incredibly blurry vision most days for about the last two years i really want to wear this top but the sleeves are soaking i need to iron it so i just kind of assumed that it was my anxiety that was making me like really blurry and fuzzy. I had an eye test about five years ago and I think you're supposed to have them sort of every three years but when I had my last eye test the guy said that I had 20-20 vision. So yeah I've always like bragged about my vision being really good. Never, literally didn't even think that it would possibly be just like my vision and that I needed glasses now and that it had finally caught up with me. And the other day I put these glasses on that are Joel's and they're quite strong um, and it's mainly, I should mention, long distance um, ironing with Georgia. I can't believe how blurry my eyes have been. I've always been thinking it was anxiety and it turns out I need glasses. So Joel has lent me his glasses for the week and I've got an eye test on Wednesday. Today is Monday and I have a rehearsal for the show tonight. The show starts on Thursday. Let's go. I'm always one step behind. Wishing I could read your mind, but I'm ready. Yeah, never ready. I wish I could have made it stop. The first time that you stood me up, I wasn't ready. Yeah, never ready. Here. <laughs> I'll link all your uh, Instagrams and stuff, you know. Thank you. Welcome. <laughs> you know, I like to do the poor a favour. <laughs> <laughs> You've got some great effects in the show. <laughs> well, I'm just making sure that I'm ready for my show. Are you, do you feel ready? Uh, yeah, can I go to that car? Hey guys, they're about to start the show now. The first section is Les Mis. I don't really like Les Mis, that's an unpopular opinion, so I'm not in that. Um, but I am ready for Cats. I'm going to show you some of the Les Mis section from the side of the stage and probably some views and shots from the front of the stage as well. Last show. <laughs> <laughs> so 
So we're just about to do Miss Saigon. I'm never in focus, let's just accept that. Um, this is the stage. These are my hot pants. Boots, hot pants, a bit of a sultry number. So, got lipstick on my teeth. And so We have just had the after party. I wanted to film more than I did really, but I still filmed quite a bit. And now I'm just sat with some toast. I hope that something interesting happened in this vlog. I love you. Bye. Bye guys.